So y'all, I experienced like a legit miracle today. Or I guess by the time this video posts, it probably actually occurred yesterday. But I got to school a little bit early this morning, so before I got out of my truck and went in the building, I just kind of sat and scrolled through Facebook or something like that. Which doesn't seem like a big deal, but it becomes very important for this story later on. So I got out of my truck, went into the building, started my day, and right after lunch, they called us out for an assembly. And out of habit, I, apparently I'm a, a major creature of habit I'm finding out out of habit when I walk outside I always check my pockets I go phone wallet keys and this time when I checked I went phone wallet and my keys were not in my pocket so um, I went back to my classroom I checked around my desk and everything couldn't find them um, I was kind of freaking out a little bit because I, I needed to check in my truck to see if they were there, see if I had locked them in the truck, but I couldn't because I had to get over for this assembly. So I sat through the entire assembly, assembly thinking, oh man, if I lock my keys in my truck, uh, I'm as good as dead. My wife is like 45 minutes away at home. She's not gonna wanna bring me the spare. I'm in trouble. So after the assembly, I rush over to my truck. Um, I, first thing I did, I checked the door. It was locked. I ran around to the passenger side. I looked in at the at the ignition. There were my keys. I had locked my keys in my truck. And this happens more often than I than I care to admit. Like I've locked my keys in my truck so many times, and it's because um, again I'm a creature of habit. And my habit for when I get out of my truck, I turn the ignition off. I immediately grab the keys out, open the door lock the door, shut the door, turn around and go. Like it's not even, it, it, it just happens on autopilot. But remember on this particular morning, my autopilot was messed up because I sat in my truck and scrolled on my phone. So I skipped the part where I took my keys out of the ignition. So I ran around to the, to the driver's side. I have those little buttons on my door where you can punch in a four digit code. There are five buttons and you make up a four digit code and it'll unlock your doors. Unfortunately, I don't know my code because this is a used truck and I've, I never figured out what it was. And I've done this literally every time I've ever locked my keys in the truck, which again has been a, a bunch of times. I just randomly start hitting buttons like one, 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 two, 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 three, 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 three. Just come on, just unlock, come on. And it has never worked. It has never worked until today. I started pressing buttons. At first it was just random, and then I started trying like systematic things like one, two, one, two, uh, nine, 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 eight, 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 eight. And you know what happened? The door unlocked. It was kind of a miracle, I'm pretty sure. Because after the door unlocked, I got my keys out of the ignition. I was like, what in the world? Did I just, like, did I figure out the code? Took the keys out of the ignition, locked the doors back, shut the door, and I started pressing buttons again. And I got it to unlock one more time. So I thought, hey, I'm, I'm narrowing down the code. I'm gonna figure this thing out. So I locked it back, tried again, tried again, tried again. I cannot figure out what that code was, y'all. I cannot get these doors to unlock again using uh, the keypad. I don't know what the code was, but somehow, by chance or by miracle, I just happened to hit the, the right combination of four buttons just when I needed to. After saying a prayer, and I was able to get my keys out of my locked truck. So yeah, there's my miracle story. I don't know if you've ever experienced a miracle like that. If so, let me know down in the comments of the video. I'd like to hear them. And I'm not making light of, of miracles, like for real. I do believe miracles can happen. I do believe this was kind of a bit of a miracle. 
maybe not on par with a lot of miracles that others have encountered. It wasn't like the biblical plagues or anything. In fact, in the grand scheme of things, it was kind of small, but for me, it was kind of a big deal. So, yeah, that's my story, and I'm sticking to it. Let me know yours down in the comments. Thanks for watching. I really hope you enjoyed it. If so, hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe and ring that notification bell so you'll know when to come back for more daily sustainable living. And if you're a content creator, then I recommend checking out steamit.com. It's a social media platform where your hard work and creativity pays off in a cryptocurrency called Steam. If you're interested, I'll leave a link down in the show notes. Hope to see you there.